God is saying to you today, if you are an alert, faithful believer of God, you must remember that according to the Jewish Gendar, the Feast of Cut, which begin on October 17th, this month is ending today on October 23rd, and this feast is not just about marking the close of a biblical festival. It is ending many things in the lives of believers. As well, just as the Israelites of old dwelt in temporary shelters reminding themselves of God's provision, and this feast has served as a time for contemporary believers to ponder, just as it did for them in the desert, on God's protective hand in their lives. But now, as this holy time comes to an end, a prophetic shift is occurring. Just as the last day of the celebration of Sim Torah, the annual cycle of Torah readings, marks the end of one cycle and the start of a new one. A divine reset is occurring in the spiritual realm, and what is being closed off will give birth to the new beginnings, new opportunities, and a renewed outpouring of God's promises. This is not the end, however. Rather, it is the closing of one chapter and the beginning of a new one. If you have been pleading for a breakthrough, know that now is the moment for it. There will be another chapter in your life that is full of God's favor and supernatural action. The Spirit of God is telling believers that when the circuit ends, so does the wilderness season in your life. You won't be left wondering when God's promises will come true and the obstacles that have been preventing you from moving forward. The walls the enemy built to keep you from your destiny are falling down now. You will no longer have to live in poverty or be constrained by doubt or dread because the Lord is giving you clarity. In the same way that the Feast of Suruit reminds us of the transient nature of life, we must be vigilant because the end of the world is near and God's reign is closer than ever. The Feast of Surit may be coming to an end today, but a season of divine restoration, healing, and harvest is beginning. So enter it with hope, knowing that the God who the moment of transition has here, embrace it for the Lord is with you. Dwell with his people in the desert is still with you today guiding you into the fulfillment of his promises. Keep your eyes on him, because what he has in store for you is better than anything you could have ever imagined. To become an esteemed part of our community with us type Amen. If you believe in God, then subscribe our channel.